And the journey continues. Chicken Parm Throwdown 2024. We're at the Rome in Franklin, Massachusetts. We are on a mission to find the best chicken parm around. We've been to Chicago. We've been to Vegas. We've been to Boston. We've been to New York. And we are looking for the best of the best. Last year, Chicago won the Chicken Parm Throwdown title. The year before that, New York City. Massachusetts, will you take the crown back? Three. And we think, if we remember correctly, the chicken parm comes with either a soup or a salad, and um, maybe a choice of pasta. I think so. We'll it's been a while. You. It's been a while since we've been here. This is a room that they're not currently using right now. It is a busy night here in the dining room, but we just snuck into this side room here. We got a drink, super fast service at the bar. Yeah. Very impressed. So here's a quick glance at the menu at the Rome, starting with the appies. Sandwiches. We got some pasta alfredo salad, soup of the day. Pasta menu, chicken from the sea, pizzas. But you know where we're here from. We're here for that chicken palm. So shout out to Gold Circle members, uh, the Dowlings. This is their home turf. They've been coming to the room for years. Their drink specials here. You already know I always go with the handy dandy but light. So it's currently 19 degrees outside in Massachusetts, so me and the lovely Jen went with the chicken noodle soup here. It's homemade. The soup is delicious. Nice and hearty. Go to the last bite. This is literally uh, 9.2. 9.2. So you've had better soup, but only 102 better? 102 better. It's very good. This is the chicken noodle soup. Look at these noodles, fresh veggies, that bread on the side. Look at what Michael's doing over here. How can he say that's one of 10? That's what he's doing on the other side of the table. What do you rank it? On the soup scale, it's a 10. Ladies and gentlemen, the PAs, the resistance have arrived, that chicken farm. As you can see, it's coated in that ooey, gooey mozzarella cheese. I got the penny. I have an upgrade option. I went with the homemade cheese ravioli option, which looks amazing and has some extra melted cheese on top. As you can see, the same amount of chicken. I got my sauce on the side. She got the gravy on the usual. side. She put the um, little sauce on there for the Instagram. You can see that Instagram pour shortly. Um, just, I just like a little bit of. Um, moisture on there. I don't like too much sauce. I like to be able to see what I'm working with. And as you can see it's pounded thin. It looks like it's crisp to perfection as I like to say. And I gotta say so far soup game on point. Bread game on point. Ooey gooey cheese game on point. We're gonna let you know what that taste is. It's actually very very good. Very, very good, ladies and gentlemen. We don't get that response from Michael very often. Tell me about it. I'm gonna say the consistency of the thin cut and the grill is as close to my mom's chicken cutlet as you can get. I'm gonna give this a uh, nine one. Place has never been empty. This is an institution in Franklin. Um, some Go Circle members um, have recommended it, but even before them, their parents have been going here. I gave this a 9.1. Jennifer's Journey so far, best meal of 2024. Chicken Parm Throw on episode one of 2024. We're gonna go to more spots. We, we, we didn't do many Chicken Parm Throws in 2023, but we're gonna go back to the old school. I'm gonna chicken say it's gonna be a while so we'll beat this. We're, we're, both, find we're both saying it's our favorite meal of 2024, so this is the one to beat, guys. This is the one to beat. We'll see what's out there. And I gotta tell you, the tab was on, uh, under $60. Wow. Two chicken parms, two soups, Wow. and two beers. That's two beers total? Yeah. That's a good deal. So does that move it up to a ton? I mean, you can't beat that deal. Thank you so much to the Coley's family and the excellent staff over at the Rome. We loved it per usual. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're not already, please subscribe and follow us on Instagram on Jenical's Journey. Cheers.